All right, so check this out. I am here in the iconic GM Design Dome here in Warren, Michigan to show you these two vehicles right here. This is the new 2024 Buick Encore GX. Behind me, I have the ST, and over there is the Avenir, and that's what we're gonna talk about today. All right, so here's the deal for 2024 model year, there's going to be three different trim levels of the Buick Encore GX, kind of like there was in the past. However, it is going to be different because first and foremost, it's gonna have the preferred, which we always started with. However, the ST, which we're looking at right here, is a new trim level in and of itself this year. Gone is the S, or pardon me, the Select, and now is the, um, is the ST platform that we're seeing right here. Then, instead of the Essence, we now have the Avenir, the beautiful range topping Avenir. This is the first time we're gonna see this in the Buick Encore GX. Now, heading over here very quickly, let's talk about some of the new design cues that we're seeing. First and foremost, if you couldn't already tell, brand new front end here. Check out this shark look that it has out the front. I love those kind of check mark headlights it has here and a brand new logo now. The first one, the first Buick with this new tri shell logo, I think it looks sleek, I think it looks modern, I think it looks phenomenal. That is the new logo that they're using, they're gonna be using throughout the brand as we move forward. Now, the ST, as I mentioned, is a new trim level in and of itself, and you're gonna see it does have a lot of black accents, the black grille. You can barely notice the ST here, so it's kind of nice, it's kind of, you know, so this blends in. Black here along the bottom, paint to black, down along the wheel wells, the bottom of the doors, and black wheels. Now, these are a 19 inch black wheel, they're uh, an option. They're gonna come with standard wheels uh, that are 18s, look the same way though power tailgate here in this one as you can see check that out there's that nice buick logo here in the back also dimensions and frame uh, remain the same as the outgoing model um so you know again this is their most popular model they didn't want to change a whole lot in terms of that because it was working leatherette interior in this you can have black here as you can see but you also have the option for a whisper beige when we get over to the um the avenir there I'm gonna show you what that looks like. But again, this is leatherette interior. In your preferred, it's gonna be cloth, okay? Well, cloth with the leatherette on the outside of the seat, actually. Keyless entry on all the uh, four doors. Side blinds on alert is gonna be a standard feature amongst all trim levels, which is awesome. Bose stereo system in this. There's your power tailgate button, as I mentioned. Sunroof is an option, this, or moonroof, uh, panoramic moonroof. There's the new tri show logo here on the actual steering wheel. And check this out. 19 inches, I'm gonna show you in the other vehicle which is turned on, uh, to show you how the screens work, but 19 inches of overall screen in this now. It is fully programmable in front of the driver. They've changed down here a little bit, the configuration. No separate climate control on this one, but you do get the Avenir, you do get that. Heated seats, of course, as you can see there. Uh, heated steering wheel as well. But again, what a sharp looking vehicle this is. And as I mentioned already, this is why it's one of their best sellers. Pricing I'm gonna put on here when I when I have the information in front of me. So you'll see it here in the text, but it's gonna come in for a luxury car as far as I'm concerned with a luxury warranty. You're gonna see this. Oh, by the way, black mirror caps on this too to go with all the other black features. Oh, and of course the black roof. I forgot to mention that as well. Now, check out, and that's the Cinnabar red, by the way, um, color. The Avenir, first time we're seeing this in the Encore GX. This is the range topping trim level. How phenomenal does this look? Now, the color of this is deep, uh, deep ocean. I think it's deep ocean metallic. It's metallic color regardless, but it's deep ocean. Again, with the jewelry looking logo here out front. And speaking of jewelry, check out this grill down here. Almost looks like a mouth, right? Of this shark. Uh, I was told when you see it in uh, the gray color comes out, it really looks like a shark, but I really like what they've done with this front end. Looks very classy and it really, you know, blends itself well with, you know, what Buick offers in the Buick line. Now, heading around the side, we're going to see this one, unlike the ST, has paint matched down here all along the bottom, all right, as opposed to the black. <clears throat> I think that's great. Standard here is 19 inch pearl nickel wheels. That's the only wheel option you're going to get with this one this year. Then, taillights. By the way, taillights, headlights, LED. Uh, these are, of course, just uh, kind of clear smoked out as opposed to the dark red that you're seeing over there uh, with the ST. Again, the logoing looks fantastic. Again, the jewelry type look in this is what they like to call it, and I like to agree with that. Um, it just looks phenomenal, the touches on this. Again, of course, you got the power lift gate back here. Again, lots of storage for a mid 
you know, subcompact uh, SUV. Here is what I mentioned, of course, there's a keyless entry, all four doors, there's your panoramic sunroof again, but here's that whisper beige I was speaking to. Check out the stitching in here. Look how phenomenal that looks. Of course, these seats will drop down. Uh, that front seat will drop down there as well. And then checking over here, you're gonna see again, obviously memory seats in this one, uh, which is nice. Tons of you know options, this, but here's the screen that I wanted to show you when I was in the other vehicle. Check this out. Again, they say it's 19 inches of overall screen. It's so clear. And another one of the big things, I'm not sure if it'll work for me right now, if the backup camera will come on, it's not because it's not running, but oh, the trunk's open, that would, that would help. But it does have an HD camera in here now, so you know, it blends itself well with, of course, the nicer newer crisper, a crisper screen you're now going to have the ability to have the hd camera as opposed to the old one so um right here this is all programmable you can play around with this and change different things right right there apple carplay android auto still uh you have google maps in here um surround vision camera in this one as well of course it's not going to work because i have oh it does okay i have to tailgate up but anyways it has a surround vision camera in this which is really slick uh really nice to use and again they've changed all down here as well so this whole area here is also changed of course your your tri uh tri logo here but they've also changed down here so it's now separate climate control for your driver and your passenger needless to say there's no question that they've hit the ball out of the park with these new Encore GXs. I can't wait to get in one. I can't wait for you to get in one. Thanks for watching. Until next time, take care.